Hey guys, this is Jono from Simple Cookery. Welcome back to another episode. Today I'm gonna to be showing you how to make some smooth and creamy mashed potatoes. It's a key staple that I think every home cook should learn because it's such a great foundation to any sort of dish. You can serve it with some steak, some lamb chops, any sort of stew, and it's just a really good foundation for any sort of hearty meal. So let's go through the ingredients. We've got six today. First up, we've got some potatoes. For the potatoes, try and get some really starchy ones because these have less moisture, which is gonna make your potatoes fluffier and creamier. Next, we've got butter, some milk, and then to add some flavor to the potatoes, we've got some garlic and rosemary, and then we're just gonna garnish with some chives at the end. So let's get started. The first step is to peel and wash your potatoes. I'd actually recommend doing this step over the sink. It makes it much easier. Once your potatoes are peeled and washed, we're going to cut them into small cubes. I like to cut my potatoes into smaller cubes because this will help the potatoes cook through quicker and make our mashing process much easier. Once your potatoes are cut, transfer them into a large pot and fill up the pot with water. Make sure the water covers every single piece of potato. Next, salt your water with a teaspoon of salt. Cover with a lid and bring your pot up to a rolling boil. Once the water starts boiling, we wanna cook the potatoes for another 20 minutes. Whilst the potatoes are cooking, we are going to infuse our butter with our garlic and rosemary. So we're gonna start off by crushing three cloves of garlic and you just need to remove the skin, you don't need to finely dice or anything. Transfer your butter into a pot over low heat and slowly melt your butter. As your butter is melting, add your garlic and your rosemary. Because the butter is slowly heating up, this will help release the flavors of the garlic and the rosemary. Once your butter is melted, just take your pot off the stove and let the garlic and rosemary sit there and infuse slowly while the potatoes are cooking. After 20 minutes, the potatoes should be done. So now we're going to drain these over the sink and then let the potatoes sit in a colander for two to three minutes and let them steam. This will really help dry out the potatoes and remove excess liquid, which will help create more fluffier mashed potatoes. Another tip to remove excess liquid from the potatoes is to transfer the potatoes into a pot over low heat and just cook it out for another minute. You can see now when we move the potatoes around with our spatula, we should be getting that dry and fluffy consistency from the edges of the potato. Now the potatoes are ready to be mashed, so we are gonna get our potato masher and just mash the potatoes until we get a smooth consistency. Before we add in our garlic and rosemary infused butter, we are just gonna take out the rosemary and the garlic. And then just pour your butter into your potatoes. Make sure you leave aside a bit of butter because we're gonna use this to garnish at the very end. Once the butter goes in, just mix it in with your masher. Next, we're gonna add half a cup of our milk. When you add liquid into mashed potatoes, this will help loosen up the consistency. By adding half the milk first, we can control the texture of the potatoes as we go and just combine the milk into the mashed potatoes. At this stage, the consistency should be loose enough for you to use a spatula to move the potatoes around gently. This is looking good, so we are going to add the rest of our milk and then stir that through. Depending on how you like your mashed potatoes, you can even add a little bit more milk to loosen it up. Once your potatoes are at the consistency and texture that you like, we are going to season them with salt and pepper. As you are seasoning, I recommend you keep tasting your potatoes just to make sure you're not over salting your mashed potatoes. Serve the mashed potatoes in a bowl. And I'm just gonna create a little well with a spoon so that we can add our gorgeous garlic and rosemary infused butter. Finally, garnish with some finely chopped 
chives. And there we go guys, our amazing mashed potatoes with our garlic and rosemary infused butter. Enjoy. Alright, let's try this creamy mashed potatoes. Look at this. Mmm. 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 The garlic and the rosemary really take it up to the next level. Yeah. Yeah. Definitely. And you can serve this with some sausages, some steak, as I said earlier, some stew, a hearty stew on a winter's day. Oh, beautiful. It's just a really good side dish for any sort of occasion and any sort of dish. Thank you so much for watching, guys. As always, give this video a big thumbs up if you found it helpful. Drop a comment down below and let us know what other recipes you'd like to see on this channel. Hop over to our Instagram page. I'll leave a link in the description box down below. You want to keep up to date with what's going on, just some behind the scenes of all our shoots. Subscribe if you haven't already to see the next episode on Simple Cookery. We upload simple recipes and cooking techniques to help you guys get more confident in the kitchen. Anyways, guys, bye-bye.